This is orcish writing. Um, it says you need to bathe the artifacts in the juices of blah blah. blah. I'm a vendor that's Whatever. Right. Looks like you just need to collect some blood fruit. What the hell? What's a blood fruit? It's a squishy thing that grows on the trees over here. <laughs> There's a lot of chests in this game. If you guys didn't notice already, I do like my, um, elemental weapons. <laughs> oh, I figured that out. Hey, there's nothing wrong with a good elemental weapon. I, I never said there was, but some of the times you stole my kills when you were helping me. Some of those were bullshit uh, kills. Suck it up, princess. <laughs> Help! Take a cup of concrete and harm the hell up. Ooh. Um. Mm. So. Hey, did you hear about the um the system update for PS3 that apparently would PS3 go on Cricket? Yeah. Whoa! I heard about it, but I went to trees. I actually stupidly enough went to go check cool my system update. This piece actually was an update, but turns out I'm I'm up to date. I'm happy. Yay! I laugh if I did break your console, then I'd laugh even freaking harder. Dude, if that happened, I would cry. I would cry so hard. I would. I would probably go into like a deep state of depression. Like without a doubt. Mm, you obviously have no life if you go into deep depression from uh, your console being bricked. Hey, I have a life. Just not the life that everybody else wants for me. Uh, I guess you're better than some people in a way. Ah. Oh yeah, well, understand. Ooh. Oh, right. Mm. You know, I'm gonna see if, see what's up with this half of two thing. Mm. Can you believe it took me eight months to finish Doom Three on my PS3? Man, Doom Three sucks. Oh, it's I love it. It obviously fell over in the dark and forgot it was a fucking shock too. <laughs> I loved it. It took me eight months fucking to finish the. I it took me eight months to finish the main game, but I loved it. Now I gotta do the two DLCs and then all of every single thing for Doom One and Doom Two. Yeah, it seems like a load of crap. Hmm. Oh crap, that's right, I'm up to the part where there's a sniper's at City 17. Alrighty guys, well we're gonna take a quick 5 minute break, um, here, or 2 or 3 minute break, while I just check some comments on the chat section, and then we'll, uh, be back. Mm, what do I want, what do I want?
Sweet. Now if we go control shift A, that'll take us to that one. Sweet. And we're back guys. Um sorry about that. We just had a quick um I had to quickly go do something. Um, I think that should take us back into the game for you guys, yep. Um, so yeah, this time we're going to have the camera here, so you can sort of see reactions. Um, we'll be switching between that and our other live stream view, um, over the next couple of times. Good. So. Now, smear it on the artifacts, please. Screw you, zombie. Screw you, zombie. You're very ah. violent towards zombies. Well, these are not regular zombies. These are Half-Life zombies. These things are nasty. <laughs> oh, God. These things are nasty. Crap. <laughs> I hate those things. Morty, you look different. Yeah. Oh, it's the... Where's your party? Oh, I hate those friend. things that, like, bolt at you. We told you what happened to Bloodwing. Mmm, mmm. So anyway, she's so cute! Where is she? I don't even know where to go now. Just... Oh, I'll go this way. All right. But they are cheap. You know, that's probably one of the things I've loved about Half-Life. It gives you the... These moments when you just don't know where the hell you're going. Welcome to ye old bullet emporium. Huh. Like, and I think that's what gave a lot of people a lot of trouble in the first Half-Life. Because <laughs> you're just like, where am I going? Yeah. Holy hell. Sniper, where is he? Down and... I hate snipers. Friggin' hate snipers. Oh, these guys in Half-Life are being a bit of a pain in the ass. I remember you couldn't take them out in the first Half-Life. Um, I want to put that one into... Yeah, got him! That slot. Man, I own... Ah! What? Where? Who? Over. Who's over here? Yeah. Oh. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, hi, Bonnie. I took care of that little problem. Okay, Barney, where are they? Well, it does look pretty. Scenery looks pretty. The DLC seems to be very well constructed, considering it was all in house with uh, Gearbox. Yeah, usually when things are fully in house constructed, they seem to lack the little the 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 um ah! the certain thing that makes them you know makes the game what it is. Yeah. Like, if you have a look at um, the DLC for. Eh! These are skeletons. Protect me, Death Trap. Um, if you have a look at the very first Bull, um, Bioshock DLC, you know, that was created in house and it sucked. Hmm, well, that's it, uh, but... But uh, if you have a look at the second DLC that wasn't made in-house, it, it was actually really, really good. Yeah, well, I still want to do all the DLCs. I meant for the original Bioshock. Yeah, I actually wouldn't mind going back for them, but, you know, I don't know, I just haven't played Bioshock on my PS3 in God knows how long. Because <laughs> I've got, like, I've still got to finish off Slara Coon. I barely touched it because of my playing everything on my computer and I've gotten this game on my PS3, that Bleach game I showed you when I was up at yours last. I wanted to buy it at that time. 
I finally found a copy here down in Sydney, and um, I've been playing that ever since. So I swear to God, it's not that I hate Slaracoon, it's just I'm still I'm still on a Japanese level. Yeah, Slaracoon was a good game considering we got it a month a month before the rest of the Australian public. So. Yeah. I think I'm in the wrong area. Control Shift A. Barney! Um, I look, love Barney. Guys, I've got the video camera on, as you can probably tell. I'm pretty. <laughs> um, just to sort of break up the live stream a bit. Um, but I've gone and I come and actually have an RPG, and as you can see, it's overpowered and even killed me. Um, damn it! I missed him. No, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. That's your own fault. Hey, big fight. That's another name for the head crabs. Head humpers. Fantasy world. I really don't like these fast ones anymore. They give me neurotoxin that like almost kills me. <laughs> I can take a bath in this stuff. <laughs> Glad I'm yeah. Sacro Portal 1. Ah, <laughs> uh, neurotoxins. Ah, uh, floating, floating, floating. Okay, here's a question for you guys at home and you guys watching. The number one best villain or bestly voiced villain in a game for the past six years. Mitchell? Um, you know what? Um, oh, okay, I'm gonna have to think about that one. I must yeah. admit, it's GLaDOS for me. GLaDOS is the ultimate anti-hero. <laughs> anti-hero. Um... <laughs> Duke, Duke Nukem is a close second. Damn luck. He's not a villain. This next fight won't work He's a hero. Time. He's a Should badass hero. Until Roland shows up. Stop. Um... Roland's not... Ooh, I got ooh it, I got you it, got it, me it. thinking about it, Duke Nukem now. Um, okay, More okay, uh... Shh, hold on for just a second. Dialogue. The white knight. For only um, in the way. I'm gonna have to go into no, silent mode for a while Wait, while what? I think about this. <laughs> um, well, if you if you hang up, my computer will automatically re-answer your call when you call again. <laughs> no, I mean I'm just gonna stay here and just like not say a thing, <laughs> or at least try to try to shut the hell up. Death I'm like scanning my memory base of like virtually everything just to figure it out. Hmm. Best villain in a game. Activate speed time. Wait, you said the past six years, yeah? Yes. Crap. Um. Mm. 